This is our receptionist, Pam. Pam! 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 Pam Beasley. Uh, Pam has been with us um, for forever. Right, Pam? Well, I don't know. If you think she's cute now, you should have seen her a couple of years ago. What? Jim Halpert. Hey. Hey, New York. Happy Halloween. Thanks. My costume's getting a lot of attention. So, apparently no one dresses up for Halloween here. I wish I'd known that before I used grease paint for my mustache. And I can't even take off my hat because then I'm Hitler. <laughs> I think those might be empty. No, no, because the ice melts and then it's like second drink. You guys can finish that? All right, yeah. Sing another song, dude. Well, last year I got great work, so I don't... <laughs> And this next award is going out to our own little Pam Beasley. I think we all know what award Pam is going to be getting this year. It is the Whitest Sneakers Award because she always has the whitest tennis shoes on. Get on down here. Pam Beasley, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, here we go. I have so many people to thank for this award. <laughs> okay, first off, my kids because yes. I couldn't have done it without them. Thank you. Let's give Michael a round of applause for emceeing tonight because this is a lot harder than it looks. And also because of Dwight, too. Um, so finally, I want to thank God because God gave me this Dundee and I feel God in this Chili's tonight. Woo! What a great year for the Dundies. We got to see Ping, and we learned Michael's true feelings for Ryan, which was touching. And we heard Michael change the lyrics to a number of classic songs, which for me has ruined them for life. What? Nothing. Okay. What? I don't know. What? Oh my god. You are so drunk. Did you get that? <laughs> oh my god. Whoa. I just want to say that this was the best Dundies ever. Okay. Whoa! Whoa. Closing time. Time for you to go home to the places you will be from. Let's see, Andy has been manager for 105 days, which means I've heard closing time 105 times. Still don't know the words. And when I was home and home and home. I am actually looking forward to take your daughter to work day. I am not great with kids, but I want to get better because I'm getting married. So I put out a bunch of extra candy on my desk so the kids will come talk to me. Like the witch in Hansel and Gretel. Pam, I'd like you to keep a log of everything Michael does hour by hour so that we can analyze it at corporate, okay? Oh, I Thanks, don't know, Pam. Pam. It's weird. Jan used to treat Michael like he was a 10-year-old, but lately it's like he's five. Hey, Coselli, the cars, Cosby. I love Jello Pudding Pop, my son Theo. Sometimes I think she holds on to faxes. I don't care what they say about me, I just want to eat. Which I realize is a lot to ask for. At a dinner party. Oh, I'm not even close. So, we keep a very tidy house. We should see our bathroom after Michael takes a bath. Whew. I don't have to tell you, Pam. Yeah. Wh what? Oh, well, don't tell me that he's really changed since you guys dated. Oh, are, are you joking? Well, Michael told me a little bit about it, but I see the way you look at him. I have never, ever dated or wanted to do anything resembling dating Michael. <laughs> ever. Not ever, not now, not then, not now, not ever, mm. ever. I've noticed how you look at him at the office. Mm-hmm. Pam. 
I hope she didn't do anything to the food. Like, like what? I can't prove it. But I think she might be trying to poison me. Hey, it looks great, babe. Yeah, it really does. I know Jan didn't poison the food. I know that. But if she was going to poison the food of someone at that table, wouldn't it be me? Michael's former lover. Hi. Good morning, can I help you? Yes, I'm from Techstar, about a new phone system for you. I was wondering if I could talk to Michael Scott. I'm sorry, he's not in right now. Really? He's never around when I come by. Shoot. They have new phone systems now that can ring directly to a salesman, or someone presses star and they go to accounting, basically 95% of my job. But I'd like to see a machine that puts out candy for everyone. Vending machine. The reason that I got bad customer reviews is because I didn't. There is a massive conspiracy going on here, and I know you're involved. Dwight, get out of my nook. That's what she said. That's what she said. That's what she said. Good one. Would a liar or bring Minnie Mounds bars? You nervous about seeing Karen again? Since she was the other woman? Actually, you were the other woman, so. No, that was a long time ago. Is that why you're wearing makeup today? No, I'm not even wearing that much. I hate the idea that someone out there hates me. I even hate thinking that Al-Qaeda hates me. I think if they got to know me, they wouldn't hate me. But Karen knows me and she still hates me, so. Oh, wow. <laughs> that is amazing. I feel like a real Puerto Rican. Michael, you're all set at Botticelli, so I changed the reservation to two people. Karen, look. Fun! Yeah. Wow, Botticelli's, that sounds like a special occasion. Yeah, no, it's nobody. <laughs> I don't know, I think Michael has a date. <laughs> No. Yeah, I think you have a date. I don't. I don't. Come on. Oh, I think we should just drop it. Because obviously he doesn't want to talk about it. I don't deserve this, guys. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Just take the parrot. Okay. Back to the old grind. I was probably going to break up with her anyway. Oh, don't. that's too bad. Pam, it is very complicated. There are a lot of moving parts here. Sounds complicated. Yeah, but I mean, if you really like this person, then you should see where it goes. You want me to be happy? Of course. Part of the problem is, she is the mother of a close friend of mine. Oh. More than a friend. A co-worker. Oh. Gossip. Who is it? Who is it? Who is it, Michael? Who? It's okay. No, 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 no. No. I'm going to give you a raise, Pam. Why? Because of all the good work you've done. I have the lowest sales record of anyone here. D d no, no, it's not about numbers, Pam. It's about attitude. I have the worst attitude of any person here. Oh, come on, what do you want? What do you want? Do you want a million dollars? Do you want to hit me? You want me to get down on one knee and beg you? I, I want, want to hit you. What? I want to hit you, I'll do that. <laughs> okay, what? I don't, are you kidding? No, are you kidding? No, I don't. All right, come on, I'll take off my jacket and tense my stomach, and you just, just. No, I don't think I can hit you in the office. Okay. So um, we'll do it after work. Hmm. In the parking lot, in front of everyone. I'm gonna hit you as hard as I can. Okay. Pam, Pam. I'm really sorry. I'm sorry. What are you sorry for? So many things. I don't know. It's hard to choose. How about for dating my mom? Maybe that's And it. dumping her on her birthday? Yeah. Yes. <sighs> okay, just don't ever date a member of my family again. Okay, I promise. For the record, your mom came on to me. <laughs> <laughs>